Hey guys, welcome to Diecast Reviews, and welcome to Monthly Green Light Reviews Episode 5. Today, uh, as you can see, I'll be doing a review on a Green Light Single and a Green Light Hitch and Toe 2 pack, I guess you can call it uh, that. So, the single here will be the 2009 Ford Mustang GT. Uh, it is a Hobby Hobby exclusive uh, casting, uh, which basically means I think it's exclusive to hobby stores like Hobby Lobby and stuff like that. Um, but uh, yeah, I, I, the Hobby Hobby exclusive ones are usually the best ones in my opinion. Um, although I really like the, uh, which one? This one, the Hobby Shop uh, series as well. I really, I like that one. But uh, the Hobby Hobby ones are usually very, very nice. But uh, yeah, here's the Ford Mustang GT. looks very nice and here is the hitch and toe uh two pack uh, with the 2018 nissan titan xd pro 4x and the aerovolt mark ii trailer mk2 probably mark ii trailer uh very nice indeed as well the trailer looks pretty cool um so yeah uh, everything in this uh, review is blue I did not plan out for it to be that way, but it just kind of happened. Like, I showed you I have some green light cars now. Uh, in the Christmas haul video, I showed you I have green light cars that can be used for green light monthly reviews, monthly green light reviews. Uh, probably till March. I can stretch it out till March. Um, and I decided to go with these two for the first, for January, for the first monthly green light review of 2021. Uh, so we'll start off with the 2009 Ford Mustang GT. Uh, looks very, very cool. Uh, here's a look at the package. Uh, I like the uh, picture right there. And the different, like, tires are pretty cool as well. So, I'll be right back with the package all opened up. So, uh, let's get the car out of the package. Here it is. Uh, let's get this out of the package as well. But actually, that was... Uh, <clears throat> got this separate card, I guess, uh, with some details. You can pause and read that if you want. Um, looks like a promotion for uh, tires. Um, but, uh, yeah, yeah, looks like looks like a, pro a promotion for BF Goodrich tires. I don't know if they uh, worked with Greenlight on this or not. I think uh, there are some like Mopar castings that Greenlight works with Mopar or whatever to make them. But I'm not sure if uh, the tire company worked with Greenlight on this car or not. But anyways, here's the 2009 Ford Mustang out of the package. Uh, there's the number 577. Made in China, copyright 2006. Uh, but you can see a 2009 Ford Mustang GT. There's the grill with the obviously the Mustang logo there. And like I kind of showed, it does have an opening hood, which is very, very nice. Um, I think one of the first times actually I've actually gotten the hood to open up on the review. Nice detail inside. Very nice. I like the rims. Definitely really like the rims there. Got a GT Tampo right there. Uh, you can kind of see inside the car with the uh, seats there's a steering wheel there's like a cup holder right there you see a two-door car and on the back you've got the uh gas cap there another tail light right or a light right there you've got a place for the license plate it would go right there you've got some tail lights uh, i really like the way those tail lights look actually gt right there Tail light up there. You've got some exhaust pipes coming out here. And a spoiler right there. The side looks to be the same as the other side. Um, but yeah, really not much to go over with it, but I do I do quite like it. Pulls quite quite nicely as well. But yeah, like I said, I really like really like the rims and the blue paint jobs decent as well i'm not sure the lights kind of i think it's a little lighter in person than it shows up on camera actually oh my the lights kind of bouncing off it weird but i do it is lighter in person than it shows up on camera that's for sure it shows up darker on camera but uh, yeah, let's give this car a ride on the turntable well sorry about 
about that. Um, my turntable is acting weird. But, um, yeah. I do like the Ford Mustang uh, GT. 2009 Ford Mustang GT. Uh, pretty cool casting, in my opinion. That's for sure. And I definitely uh, like that. I can actually get the hood open on this one. So, let's move on to the hitch and tow. The 2018 Nissan Titan XD Pro 4X and Aeroval Mark II trailer. Uh, from series 17 on the back here you can see the uh, other cars in the set um i think i've actually seen that one at a store that one would be pretty cool to get uh those ones would be uh pretty cool to get i think i actually saw that one at a store with a bridge bridgestone enclosed car trailer but uh i didn't pick that. All right, that was quite loud, but here it is out of the package. A little protector thing. Here is the trailer. Here is the truck. And you don't want to forget this thing right here, which is like taped in there, but um, there it is. And you would insert it. Uh, actually, no, not. But, oh, it looks like you would insert it right there. Interesting spot for it. Um, but I'll do that later. Oh, I don't want to break it. Let's see. Maybe if I can get it to go here on camera. Um, yeah, there we go. Okay, I have to play around with it. There we go. Got it in there. Uh, and you kind of just have to spin it down to the bottom. So yeah, there we go. That's how you put it. Usually it's right here on the trailers, but uh, on the side for this one. So let's take a look at the uh, Nissan Titan uh, XD. 4421. Wow. Kind of a uh, large number considering this one was 577. But I think the hobby, hobby, hobby cars are uh, way more limited than the uh, just like hitch and tow cars. At least I think. Um... Uh, looks like the hood does not open on this one. Got the Nissan logo there on the front. The uh, headlights are inserted, which is very, very nice. Uh, not painted on. Although I think those ones are a separate piece, but I believe those ones are painted on right there. But uh, always nice when you get the uh, headlights inserted in. Definitely looks very nice. Got some Titan XD tampos right there. Or there you can see the uh, rear view mirrors. You can kind of see the interior of the car. Pro 4X. The rooms are pretty cool on this one as well. Go to the back. There's the rear. With the taillights. Titan XD, Titan Pro 4X. With the Nissan logo right there. <clears throat> and there's the uh, rear. And uh, there's the back. Pretty cool. This this tail this uh light's kind of sticking out you can see right there but uh, yeah anyway still pretty cool casting for sure I I do like to uh, get by these uh pickup trucks I guess I think they're pretty cool but uh, here is the Aerovolt trailer and I'm gonna say right away I love these uh like rims these these hubcaps uh yeah I really like those like dish hubcaps I think those would be referred to referred to as I really like them. But you can see Aerovolt right there. Got like kind of like a door here. I'm assuming you could go in it if you wanted to through this door. On the side, you've got like a line here that's indented. I'm not exactly sure why, but uh, there you go. Aerovolt info. I'm assuming that's a real website you could go to. Um, I wonder if that was like an agreement. Like we let, we'll let you use our product, but you have to put the website on there somewhere. I'm not sure. Or maybe that's how it is on Aerovolt. They have the website on there. I'm not sure. Uh, you can see some lights right there. Like I said, really like the rims. Tail light detail right there. On the back, you've got like some simulated hitches or whatever. Some tail lights. Tail light up there. Go to the other side. Uh, this side looks to be the same as the other one. Uh, and you've got this fin up here, which says arrow bolt on both sides and looks very, very nice. Uh, yeah, definitely like the uh, fin right there. You got little fins right there on either side. 
with tail lights or with like little lights on them. And uh, yeah, I definitely like the like curved figure figure of the uh, Airvolt trailer. We can open the back door here, maybe. Right, there we go. There's the inside. Mm. I don't know what that is, but um, yeah, there you can see the inside of it. And I would assume a car fits in there. Let's see if we can get like the uh, Ford to fit in there. Yep, fits in there just fine. Blows it up, and uh, that how it, that's how it hitches onto the truck. And uh, yeah, looks just fine. Uh, so yeah, you could probably fit you know decent sized cars in there. Probably not too long, but um, I don't know the Ford fits in there. Uh, so yeah, pretty cool. Uh, so let's give these guys a ride on the turntable. And uh, yeah, very, very nice. I actually really like the Aerovolt trailer. Um, really like the shape of it. And uh, yeah, really, really like it. So... Uh, that is all for monthly green light reviews episode five. I hope you guys enjoyed the uh, review for January. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Hit that like button, subscribe, share, comment, all that good stuff, and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.